The search continues for a suspect in Thursday's deadly stabbing in Northwest Atlanta. Fox 5 has learned the victim, 31-year-old Terry Cole, is the great nephew of legendary jazz artist Nat King Cole. Fox 5's Deidre Dukes is live near the crime scene. Uh, Deidre, a lot of folks are taking his death hard. Yeah, we're told well, that Cole was the kind of person who lit up a room, that he never met a stranger. So those who knew and loved him, as you might imagine, are taking his death very hard. Tracy had that personality that just really transcended, you know, culture. It transcended race. It transcended class. Tracy made a friend of everyone. Tracy Cole's life came to a tragic end Thursday morning. The 31 year old was stabbed multiple times at around 2 a.m. here on the 300 block of Centennial Olympic Park Drive. Medics rushed him to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. The Atlanta native was born into a legendary musical family. He was the great nephew of jazz singer Nat King Cole and traveled the world with his late grandfather, jazz great Freddie Cole. His travels with his grandfather, I mean, they've traveled around the world together, and so people know Tracy everywhere. The Cole family are longtime members of Cascade United Methodist Church in Atlanta. Senior pastor Kevin Muriel shared fond memories of the young man who was larger than life. He was family, and he was more than, you know, just a young man in the community. You know, he was, you know, that, that child who walked the, you know, the floors and the aisles of the church. He, you know, just always brought with him an abundance of joy everywhere he went. Cole was a fixture in the Atlanta cigar community and most recently worked at the Cigar City Club in Sandy Springs. The group held a virtual vigil in Cole's honor Thursday night as police continue the search for his killer. We've got to come together and stop this violence um, because uh, so many of our young men and women are being taken far too soon. He had so much more ahead of him and was doing wonderful things. And again, we're just heartbroken by this. And tributes continue to pour in on social media tonight. Uh, coming up all new at 5, we talk to some of his friends who were touched by this tragedy. They share their fond memories. That's all new at 5. In Northwest Atlanta, Deidre Dukes, Fox 5 News. All right, Deidre, we'll see you in the next hour.